Hey there, my name's Joe. I'm a learning strategist with Planet Technologies. If you're like me, you upload a ton of documents to SharePoint for your teams to use. In this episode of our Tips and Tricks series, I'm going to show you how to leverage some Power Automate templates to easily notify your team every time you upload a new document. So let's get to it. For this example, we're going to be starting from Power Automate, keeping in mind that I do have a Teams window open and a SharePoint window open. The reason is because I have a Teams channel called Tips and Tricks where we're going to make the post and I have a SharePoint link to that team where I'm going to upload the document. So let's go ahead and go back to Power Automate. And in templates, we're gonna look for Teams files, because that's generally what we want. From here, we want to see uh, a template that will notify a team of new SharePoint files. And we can see that there's one uh, right here. So let's go ahead and select this one. All right, we got green check marks, that means good. Let's go ahead and select continue. And now we're going to direct it where to look. So we want this to look inside of our SharePoint library, which is in my case, Automate, and the library name is Documents. And then I'm gonna go ahead and select a folder inside of the Documents to choose from. In my case, it's gonna be Shared Documents, and it's gonna be our tips and tricks. Now we need to point it to a team. And as we saw, I wanna point it to my Automate team. And the channel I'd like to point it to is Tips and Tricks. And let's go ahead and select Create. All right, to make sure this worked, what we're going to do is we are going to select Edit in the top left-hand corner. And then we're going to select Test on the right-hand corner. We're going to test this manually by uploading our own document to our SharePoint. So let's go ahead and select test. All right, let's perform the action. I'm going to jump over to SharePoint. I'm going to go to new and I'm just going to create a new document and exit out of it just so it saves real fast. All right, we have our brand new Excel workbook. Let's go ahead and close that. We see that it uploaded to SharePoint. Now let's go ahead and go back to automate. It says our flow ran successfully. So let's go back to teams. And we can see that there has now been a brand new post that shows that a new document was uploaded to our SharePoint, thus giving everyone in this channel the ability to see and view this file. If they select view file, it will bring them directly to the file. And there you have it. I hope this brief glimpse into Power Automate has given you some ideas on how you can make your own automations to make your life a little bit easier. If you did like the video, feel free to like and subscribe to our channel, and we'll see you next time. Thanks so much.